to eat just treats. The boys are about to fight some big, gross, fleshy things, like from the Akira. For, or the thing. Come on! I wanted to do Akira. I'm letting you know, I'm doing the thing references this whole fucking... Lou pours whiskey in a computer. <laughs> Our no! only computer. No, please pour what whiskey, whiskey in into Protect. Protect. Speaking of, Protect, it's your turn, buddy. What do you want to do? I pour whiskey into Protect. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just had to do the triple beat comedy. Uh, MILF's Magic Arrow! Third level? Milf's Wait, maybe not because that might make Do you it need like a ride from school, yeah, honey? Keep, uh, Twang. Keep no, counter spells. So only first level, I guess, of never mind. Yeah, we're all out of everything, and now there are two the things. Never mind, yeah. I can do second level MILF's Magic Arrow at but, the floating brain that's left. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a second. It's oh, gonna sound again. Yeah, yeah, that is the fresh. Gonna sound real bad. He hasn't taken a lot of damage. What happens if you hit the shrine? <laughs> it's just a shrine. Oh. So 22 to hit. And I will. Uh, yep, yeah, that's a hit. <laughs> Rolling for damage. 13 damage. <laughs> Ooh, okay, he's on the roll. And that 2d4 at the end of its next fucking turn. You're, you're very stupid, correct. Smooth skin bitch. Uh, is it, would you like to move? Whoa. Um, but um, bum bum. I move a little bit closer to my friends, about 10 uh, feet. So the, these things absorb, the reason that there's two of them is that uh, one of them is made of the like the dead people, but then the other one is made of some people who were alive, you know? Vacuum is still alive. He is. <laughs> Malcolm make me daddy. Cronenberg <laughs> me daddy. <laughs> uh, assimilate me into one gigantic lopsided horn. Oh, and hold yeah, me yeah. in your flat. Yeah, okay. <laughs> um, please, you're up. I gotta hit something with the sword, that's for sure. Oh, um, your 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 book is on the floor. Pick up the book and stow it as I get as close as I can to these fucking monsters. All right. What do I got? Well, okay, now, if you move, this guy gets an opportunity attack. Dude, Just fight the grill. Keep fucking me up. All right, what do you guys think? As Speaking as the DM, like... Or wait, you can't, can't really hit the grill. He, he has to get at least a 20 to hit you. Then right? walk away. Um, I'm going to go in front of the one to the left. Then, okay. And take that opportunity. Five. Um, so then the grill would get a free shot at you. Take it. Uh, the twenty on the dot. So you're fine. Woohoo! Thank them. I do like that. Thank the gods. And then the the statue. <laughs> <laughs> not, not, not that one. Not Could that I, one. Not that one. Specifically that one. <laughs> the other one. <laughs> Every other god but you. All right. So okay. so now that you're, yeah. you're you're right in front of this this quivering undulating mass. My Kiss it. Life. Kiss it. And I have the book. In you. my back pocket. I could use my health. Okay. I need 17 health to be at full HP, and there's no way whatever you have to heal me is going to Well, happen. no, that could happen, depending on I'm, at, I'm at 43, so we got some time. I mean, on my turn. Can yeah. I get a health report from everybody, in fact? That is at 2 HP, and there are two Eldritch Abominations. Oh, there are Eldritch Abominations. Oh, no, I didn't know there were Abominations. Specifically, uh, Aberrations. Uh, okay. I'm a, first off, first, I'm good for a while. I'm gonna hit him with a sword. The boy! Hey, Brendan, do you know what the name of H.P. Lovecraft's cat is? I do, but we don't need to say it. <laughs> okay, so... He's a superhero. Everybody knows. I still have Bardic Inspiration? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, I haven't yeah, used it yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Roll the two, adding an eight, so it's a ten. It was Bardic Inspiration. I'm gonna add that too. Okay. Because if a ten hits, I'm concerned. Okay. And it's a four, so 14 total. Yeah, that's a hit. Okay, so the now, their uh, AC is under fourteen. I do want you to know. You notice, um, Connor, as you get close to this thing, the ground within ten feet of it, it it's like doughy. It's like sticky. Like you feel yourself sinking into the ground as you walk towards it. Uh, I'm like, gonna uh, idea. So idea. I need you. Hold on. I need you to make a strength saving throw. Okay. Well, that's fine. The round, the the area around it is also full of roots and shit. Which got to be real. Uh, right? Fifteen plus eight, so twenty-three. Yeah, so you're you're fine. You will not suffer any uh, speed reduction. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Okay. Figured that wasn't gonna be a problem. Please, I need you to roll a wisdom saving throw. What the? Fuck? His best one. <laughs> Am I useless? <laughs> it's plus zero, no, buddy. Why? It's like you're asking me to lie to you. Six. Yeah. Okay. Roll a d8 for me. You shit your pants. Okay, at least it's damage, not just <laughs> your. Oh, no, it's not damage. Oh, great. One. Uh, That's how many testicles you now uh, have. You do nothing. <laughs> you're you're absolutely floored by how fucking horrifying this thing is. Is that one action? Can I use my other action? Nope. You you, you are too busy freaking the fuck out right now. You you just rushed in, man. You just rushed in. That's all I can do. 
do? <laughs> I could do the one I, thing. I'm just, look, I'm just, listen, it says anyone within 20 feet of the mouther has to do this. And But guess what? Now, now the other guys know, so. <laughs> I'm not going to go next to it. I can help in the future now. Okay, Grill gets to go. It's going to try and tentacle Steven like its favorite Japanese animes. Yeah, those are animes. That is the word for him, yep. Hentai. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, it was on the twenty for like a second, and then it pulled <laughs> up the two. Uh, six, I imagine six doesn't hit you. No. Uh, Steven, you're up. Try to scamper away from the grill and go towards Protec. Now, are you taking the disengage action to do that? Nope. Are you disengaging? All right. Yeah. All right. But you're gonna get paralyzed, buddy. I might. Uh, I'm not healing you. I'm not paralyzed. Does yeah, nine sorry. hit you? I'm, get, no. I'm guessing not. I'm okay. going to cast Counter Charm. What exactly is Counter Charm protecting them from? It just says that they get advantage on saving throws against being frightened or charmed. Um, <laughs> I mean, okay, does it does it say fear? You said from being frightened or charmed. Correct. I'm going to throw you a bone and say that even though it doesn't specifically say fear, I'm going to let it count. You want to do that one? I'm going to do that, go yeah. Different? I will use Counter Charm as my spell, or as my action, and I... Can't, um, can't do anything for you about the, the, it doesn't, the terrain, though. It just gives... Uh, le- le- it lets you roll twice, whatever that's called. Advantage. It doesn't yeah. completely protect. It'll just give us advantage. Oh, okay, interesting. All right. So it doesn't totally nerf everything. Well, so don't <laughs> count me out just yet. Um, you might be a little more fucked than I thought you were. Yeah, definitely. Good. So that's all I got, guys. <laughs> Thanks, right. Dad. Up next is the first gibbering now there. Uh, it's going to uh, it's going to try to bite, please. Let's see how much damage these things do. Uh, well, that's a 19. Mm-mm. Okay. Not good. And then it gets to make a blinding spittle attack. Oh, mm-hmm. of, of course. Um, I need you, please, to make dexterity saving throw. A nine. Uh, so unfortunately, it you, it, you like one of the mouths just like and this glob hits the ground near you. It explodes in a blinding flash of light. My God. You are now blinded until solar flare. this Mouther's next turn. Wait, you actually got solar flare. That's <laughs> awesome. So I disadvantage on my next attack? You are blinded. So that means you cannot do anything that requires sight. I mean, I know where it is. Just Vaguely swinging a weapon around does not but require he, he'll sight. probably move, and you won't know. Shay. Yeah, I might be useless during this fight, All fun right. fact, everybody. Well, but again, it's only until the end of his next turn. Yeah, but everything they do counteracts tanks things. You know? That, I mean, you should like, just throw it out listen, there. You've had every oh, status had of hurt me. <laughs> you've had every Mr. status Mr. I got of plate of mail. I'm Mr. Big Nuts. <laughs> You Big old swinging nuts. Like, Connor. Connor. Guess it'll be the powers of nature that wins this battle. Uh, Lou, you are also within the range of the Mouther. Okay. I need you to make a... Uh, Can it be constitution? It has to be wisdom. Um, wisdom. Wisdom saving throw. 17. Okay. Uh, you, you would, I, I forgot you had advantage, but 17 is enough. So you are not uh, affected by the creatures. Okay. Whatever the fuck it has going on. Yeah. <laughs> You may now take your turn. Thank I've God I recently seen. watched the movie The Thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay with fucked movie. up shit. Nice Halloween, right? uh, which one of those is Vekin? Uh, he is right here. Okay, I'm going to step next to Vekin so I can touch the boy. All right. I want to touch you him. Might wanna, you might want to watch your phrasing on that one, mate. I'm going to touch the boy. Uh, with He's a man. Let's with set that straight. Well, that's good. He's an adult consulting man. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and cast... Consulting. going to go ahead and cast Cure Wounds on the fella. Okay, uh, how much does he get? Uh, 15 plus 4, so he gets 19 health back. Damn. 19. Back oh, is back sh- in her, okay. boys. You know what? He now has 21, 21 out of 52. Okay. That's not bad. Does anybody else need health? I need 17 health. Uh, you, oh, no, I'm you, fucking useless this Kelly, fight. Just heal anybody else. Do you guys want Vekin to stay in the fight, or do you want him to back up? Yeah, I mean, is fine. he going to get wrecked? I mean, here's the thing. Does he have anything ranged? He, uh, he has a heavy crossbow. Have him get. Uh, I say, Vekin, go fight the brain. And he, he's kind of looking around. He goes, yeah, I'll do I'll do, I'll do that. <laughs> sounds sounds good, buddy. I scream over my shoulder, blind. I'll join you in a minute there, bud. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, and then, is there anything else? Here's a <laughs> Yeah, should I do health or fighting? Uh, these things have a not insubstantial amount of health. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to heal you next time. I like the way you phrase that. Like these guys are gonna hurt you. Yeah, and I big healthy boys. Yeah, yeah just two. Of them. And I guess I'll thorn whip the one that's next to please. Okay, I guess. Yes, uh, I gotta, go ahead. I gotta help him. Uh, twenty three. I have advantage though, so I assume twenty three hits him. Oh, yeah. Uh, that is tan piercing damage. All right, that's not bad. Uh, is the creature large or smaller? It is a medium aberration. Okay, I'm just keeping that in mind. So I could. I grab- ordered a large aberration. I you could don't be- know why you would. <laughs> it's, it's just I'm kidding. mouths. And <laughs> uh, okay, now it's this mouther's turn. It's Ooh, it's I'm look pictures, it's sucking six to ten feet. Helen. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna bite you. Stop. Uh, don't, does a, don't. Does a eighteen hit? Yeah. Oh boy. All right, you take 5d6 piercing damage. Wow! Jesus, that's 17 damage. Wow! That's a lot of damage. Uh, it's also going to do its binding spittle. Ex- I... Blinding spittle, excuse me. Either way. So what it's going to do is it's going to spit it right here. So you and Jake will both need to make dexterity saving throws. Is that like a bookshelf or something in between us? Can it Those see are me? pews. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Yeah. Um, I might get advantage on it. Uh, dexterity save, you said? Yep. Four. Uh, Oof. Feel like it's going to get me. Yowzer wowzers. Kellen, you are now blinded. Love it. You are blinded until the end of its next turn. Wrapped up like a douche. <gasps> than that. All right. Vekin's turn. Um, so he's got to do the thing. Disengage. Well, he, he'll try, but he's, he's still got to do the, the saving throw. Oh, shit. Okay. I hate these guys. Um... Callan, you're the closest guy to him. He has to make an attack against you. Hey. He got. That's uh, one of the things you have to do sometimes when yeah. you have the gibbering. That's a 22. Shit. That does hit. Gibbered? No, okay. Jake got gibbered, and he's attacking me no, because no, he's no. gibbered. Uh, Callan, Callan, got you gibbered. Take, oh, got you gibbered. take 13 slashing damage. Why did I heal this prick? It's not his fault. This thing drove him crazy. He he's weak. Literally no help. It is his fault. He's weak. He killed the fucking mage for you guys. Yeah. After I hey. bit his ear off. And then look what happened to the mage. Now it's two monsters. Kill stealing is a serious offense. I say, oh, sorry that I'm ungrateful as blood pours from the wound in my chest. Protect your turn. Oh, docking. Oh, Uh, all right. (laughs) No, I've seen it. (laughs) You want to give the 2D damage to the uh, grout? grout? I I do. I do. I will do it all now. Oh, I got it. Here. Okay, Uh, 2D fours, yes. That's four damage. Woo! Um, let me check his HP. Okay, he's still hanging in there. Mel says the arrow again! But it's not, yeah. <laughs> okay, Wait, no, we're gonna crossbow him in a second here. Um, I, I, the, the Mouthers are the more immediate problem. No, yeah, can I Mel say that? Yeah, the please. Mouther? You were out of range of the insanity bullshit. I wanted to shoot Mel's magic arrow. And then Mel's you go ahead better. and do Mel's. 21? Okay, yeah. 21 Mel's. Go ahead and roll your damage. Uh, six. <laughs> <laughs> But the 2D4 later. You know, that might be something. Uh, did you want to move at all? Yeah. Do you want to back the hiffle? No, up? I want to go into the insanity range because my wisdom is amazing. So. Okay. But why? Yeah, you uh, just, tell me, tell me just pot shot right? him from out there. Why are you doing this? Well, I'll, now that you know, they make a good point, now that I know I can pot shot, I'll stay out of range. Yeah. All right. Um, and that, I'll, be, I'll back you up a little bit more for good measure. Yeah. Okay. Hey, fuck that schizophrenic EMP. I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of what it is. Yeah, right? Exactly. Like, All right. Uh, please. Uh, I need you. Finally. I'm kidding. Well, you're blind. I'm going to do nothing. <laughs> I mean, he can make a shaving uh, throw no, for the insanity, can like No, 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 not until after the gibbering. Can I monster. disengage and run the opposite direction? Um, You can, but again, you're blind. Yeah, I've I'm, I'm got to run and fall over that pew. It's my plan. Okay. I'm li- my plan is to shin catch the pews and fall. Past All right. <laughs> so you, you fall down. <laughs> you spend half your movement to get back up. So that was, let's see, 5, 10. So I have five more feet? 25. 30. Uh, I was going to fall into the next pew if I could. <laughs> uh, yeah, you ran, you ran out of movement, unfortunately. And I'm blind. And you're... Can I just shoot the crossbow? No. You're, you have no hope of hitting it. Can I do anything else? Uh, you can run. I did? Oh. Run. Bang. No, I used the disengage act, so I only get 30 feet. Right? Yes, that is correct. So I did that. Thank you. Mm-hmm. So I ran. Yes. You ran so far away, but you couldn't get away. Yeah, no, I think that's everything your boy could do. All right. 
Grell, <laughs> oh, guess what? The girl's like, meh, you're blind. Meh. Ah, you don't have eyes. And he's about to take a bunch you're of You're like me, but I can see. Are Grell, yeah, they're not blind, are they? They can probably, they well, can. I mean, they don't have eyes. I'm, to be honest with you, I don't know how to. They can probably see oh, like Paul in, in Dune Messiah. They got a 22. How well, does one see without eyes? Go so nice. Is this the um, end of door number 10? You're going to take three Find damage, out. piercing damage. Okay, I can handle that. Next. Oh. And you're going to make a constitution saving throw. 10 plus 2. No, it's more than 2. Hang on. 10 plus 5, 15. <laughs> Uh, Bam. Yep. All right, you passed it. Yay! The blind man wins. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can't see, but you can move. Um, I'm gonna. Oh shit! Hold on. Yeah, dude, Hold you're on. blind. Hold up. I'm not Wait blind. Wait a minute. No, you're. Hey. Steven's not blind. He's Tell insane. Blind. But you know what? You are gonna have to do a uh, wisdom saving throw. Oh, Boy, I'm wise as fuck. Uh, it's sixteen for uh, uh, wisdom. Yeah, you're fine. Golden. I'm gonna take my only offensive action at a distance and shatter. Okay, go for it. Uh, it's not gonna hit me, is it? It probably will. Uh, I'd, I'd advise otherwise. I can probably cast it far enough back that it misses you and hits them. Yeah, if you if you cast it over by those pits that lead somewhere bad, it'll it'll just touch it, but not anyone else. Okay. Hey, by the way, guys, let's not go in the pits. I don't want to go in the pits. Um, I don't like this. You probably don't. You're not Can they roll a constitution go. save? Uh, that's 21. Most likely, well, <laughs> for uh, both of us? constitution is a plus three. Uh, full disclosure. Yeah. Is that both of them? Yes. <laughs> I'm dead. Yikes. I fuck off then. Uh, but if you want to fuck off, I need you to make a strength saving throw. Because the, the, the ground is all doughy and stuff. Or there'll oh, be no fucking more. off for you. 16? Yeah, okay. You, you, like, you manage to, like... Force your legs out of the ground. How far back do you want to go? Back towards the hallway. Uh, I'm just now realizing as everybody retreats, then oh, the monsters are going to follow us, and then we're all going to have to retreat again. Can I cash in my inspiration for a spell slot? <laughs> <laughs> Is that how that works? You went, no. <laughs> but instead of doing that, you I'm cannot bargain with God. To fist fight them. <laughs> all right, the first gibbering mouther, he's going to go up to yeah. Kellen. Stop. Oh, no, he can't. He can only move 10 feet. Oh, that's neat. Yep. Okay. Now he, he has to end his turn. There. That's useful. Uh, yeah. Ooh, your turn. Uh, I Cut assume I can feel the pew behind me and clatter myself over the back of it. I will allow you to do so, but first you have to make a strength saving throw. Doesn't his roots... I do think, yeah, the ground around yeah. me is on my roots. Yeah. So. Okay. yeah, so, so how I, would they make the ground soft underneath him if he's got roots? They're, they too. literally warp reality around No, him. yeah, it's a... It's the don't you can't question it because it's just reality. So they don't cancel out? They might just overpower you? I think reality uh, shifting. Yeah. Might yeah, overstack kind of a spell. Way. Yeah, sorry, because it's like your roots are literally being pulled into the ground, like quicksand. Yeah, I just I'll make five cool reality shifting aberrations be like. <laughs> Someone's seeping into the ground. Oh, it is. Uh, yeah, so unfortunately your spoon and treat is zero now. I love that. Well, uh, I can't see, so the only thing I can do is heal myself. Can I yell blindly at the group? Uh, yeah. Do I have uh, Hey, sort of everybody. Rest? You don't have to see to yell things, please. I'm seeing this go in a, a, a direction in which every time we move away, the things are going to follow us, and then all the ranged people are going to get overwhelmed instead of just... Oh, um, please, I forgot to mention, his turn is over, so you now have your vision back. Woo! Not blind yelling anymore. Did you do the 2D damage? Six. Sick. I'm saying I think I should just keep being a damage sponge so you guys can go volley long attacks. You're like covered in blood. Guys, I got this! need to be a damage sponge if we just kite them. What? As long as we stay That's more than slip. 15 feet away from them. More than 20 feet, because if within 20 feet... Oh, yeah. Feet, I don't think we're going to be able to. It's just, not just walk. They can only move 10 feet. What do you mean? Okay, well, let's get that <laughs> shot. Now, remember, there's still shit in this place you guys need. Yeah, I'm not saying leave, leave. Like, yeah. yeah, no, no, I agree. It'd be I, hilarious if we just like, well, we're going to go. I'm just going to walk yeah. around this room. We have a thing. Okay. I'm just saying, if we keep get, finding ourselves cornered and feared... Well, good news, please. My feet are one with the ground, so I'll be here. <laughs> Bad news, I'm officially out of range. <laughs> you dropped five inches as you made that bit. <laughs> like, I am not going anywhere. 
Anyhow, I cast Aura of Vitality, which has a healing aura within 30 feet of me. That's an action. I can then use a bonus action for the next minute to heal anybody uh, within that aura. Okay. Such looks, as me, and I Yeah, have. it looks like that's going to be you, please, and Steven. Well, I gave myself five health. Right. Oh, wait, no, I get to add four to it because of the thing, so I'm giving myself Good another four. Uh, how much, how much my... do Connor and Jake get? I, you can only do it to one person. Oh, okay. So gotcha. I so, uh, get fucked. Yep, okay. All right. Uh, Gibbering Mouther number two is going to take his turn. I hated his last nice. turn. He's going to bite you. Ah, he's he has a bite because you're blind. Oh, that's good. Uh, yeah, no, I like oh, that. Oh, no! Oh, sweet, sassy molasses. What is it, two crit 20s? That was a, no, it was one crit 20, but that's all he needs. So that's Ugh. six times five is 30. Oh, my God. Is yeah. it 30? 30, and then... Start rolling. And then, and then he rolls. another 12 on top of that. Well, yeah. then I'm unconscious. 42 damage. Uh, does anybody have the ability to heal? Um... Yeah, raise your hand if you did. Just so after you lost your remaining hit point, oh, the amount of damage oh. did not exceed your maximum HP, did it? No, you said it was forty-two total. Yeah, it did not. Okay, thank God. Yeah, so if your health, if your damage exceeds your max, your max HP, you just die. Game over, man. Why does this keep happening to me? I do scar. Hey, scar. Better men than you have died to Mouthers, Kellen. That's wow. a that's a You're not sentence. lying anymore. Yay! Yay! I can see the light. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm gonna pick you up. Um, There's no light. Oh, man. So it's, it's, it's Sir Beckon's turn. <laughs> we turned the tide, and then they turned it back. All right. This he is manages just... to shrug off the influence of the gibber. He he picks you up. Thank you. And he throws you right over here. Uh, and he goes, guys, the minute I get out of this alive, what makes you say that? <laughs> <laughs> Can I? I already didn't. But if I go down, I'm going down fighting. I'd be another one. Uh, delirious like, with death, I yelled a second. Bloody. If anybody's going down, I think it's the monster with all the mouths. Okay, uh -oh. he gets nice. he gets two hits against the gibbering oh. mouth there. Let's go. All right, so now I'm not so unhappy uh, about healing you, you fucking prick. That's 10, and that's another 12, 22 damage against the mouth there. He just chops into it. And there he goes, go. how do you like this? You stupid bitch. I'm out of things, guy. I have no more ideas. Uh, there's stuff that I could do if I were alive. I don't think anybody can alive you. I know, I have to do Well, you could do a medicine check to at least stabilize him. What? Protect, you're up, buddy. Fireball! For, for real, real? No, 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 no. I think it'd be dangerous, right? Or I mean, yeah, because like, yeah, right, the if you could get if you could get everybody out of the way first. No, the right. Hit back and right in the teeth. Nah, counter spell, just kidding. Um, I'm gonna do Melf's Magic Arrow to... This one's pretty hurt. This one has taken no damage whatsoever. The no damage whatsoever to that guy. Okay. This Tyler's one. the only useful one. This is the last one I have for Melf's. Make it a good one, buddy. Right. Oops. Uh, <laughs> 12. It's a hit. Whoa! Whoa I'll daddy! Take I'll take it. Again! Low AC, a yeah. lot of hit points. 15 okay. damage. Okay. <laughs> and plus the 2d4 at the end of their turn. So would you say that these quivering masses of flesh are glass cannons? Did we? Yes. Did yes, I did. They're also quivering yeah, masses yeah, yeah. of flesh. Uh, Tyler, is there anything else for your turn you'd like to do? Uh, besides go, ah. Please. Can I finally hit him with a sword? You have to make your strength saving throw first. I know. That's strength, strength saving throw. Probably impossible for you. But, yeah, I don't know if I could do that. Yeah. Um, seven plus eight, so that fifteen. Let me see. I think that's good. Boy, I don't like these enemies uh, at all, guys. Yeah, no, you're fine. You thank the Lord. Yep. Okay. This is fun. So, We're having fun. I'm stressed yeah. out. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so this is what you wanted, you man. <laughs> do the monkey, please. <laughs> do the monkey. <laughs> 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 I, I'm worried that you guys thought I was really mad about that. I wasn't mad. Because you, 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 you were, knew this was you're, you're all such barmy bastards, yeah. and I trained you well. It was, <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to hit him with a sword. <laughs> hi, hi, hi! The monkey man! 
This is your revenge. This is, this is why you have no aggressive bone in your body. You get it all out here. I told you, man. This is a fucking challenge. We're making this a challenge. Uh, Macho I, uh, monkey. I'm going to hit the one that's not damaged yet. Okay, so that's this fella right here. Yeah. All right, you, you passed your, pa your save, so you can go right up to him, and then you have to do your wisdom saving throw. But you have advantage because of Steven's thingamajig. Woo! So roll it twice, take the better number. Daddy, 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 one daddy, and daddy, one. Daddy, daddy. Uh, 16, so. That, I mean, yeah, that's good, man. So I don't need to roll again. You don't even, you don't even trip, dog. <laughs> don't even trip. And I won. Yeah, bro, don't even. So now I attack. Now that I've done a strength save and a wisdom save, now I'm allowed to try and hit him. Yes! Fuck. Very bad monsters. Very not good. You oh, shouldn't. Fuck up. You shouldn't have done this, guys. Don't fuck up. You shouldn't be these oh, things. I told oh, you. No. I just told you. Did you not hear? So oh, you, can you pull it back you up? You go to swing no. your sword and you let go of it, and it goes into the mouth of one of the of one of the mouths. Did you do damage? No, it swallowed it. Uh, like well, I pull swallow. out the book. <laughs> thank God I have. Yeah. got two. Holy, thank the Lord I have the book. All right, did, I'm willing did to. I, I'm willing to to let you uh, attack again. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say. Can play. I use my? Can I use my? Uh, because I have. I have dual attack. Mm -hmm. Can I use it to try and? No, it has to be an attack. Okay. Um. Me. Mm -hmm. Six plus eight, so twelve. So that hits. Yes. Six plus eight is also fourteen. Huh? Six plus eight is fourteen. Thanks. Fourteen. <laughs> fourteen. Yep. Yeah, All your damage. I, I haven't used the book in so long. I don't know what it God, is. You know, I haven't used the book for so long. I forgot how to math. Man. <laughs> the book of I really math. do need to pick up books more. Uh, D8 plus 6. Not bad. An 8. Okay. So, 14 dead. Nice. Yay. Okay. Together, and now I have my unarmed grapple. Can I try to unarmed grapple my sword out of this bitch? Grapple the sword. No, he swallowed it, bro. Yeah, I know. Yeah, but it's it's a grapple. But its stomach is okay. probably pretty close to the surface because it's all here's the, You're gonna reach in there. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let you make a dexterity saving throw. Okay. If you get below a 15, it's gonna chomp your arm. And do off. a dick ton of damage. Like yes. Can be off. Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure? Metal arm. Metal arm. <laughs> Metal. No, 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 this is gonna make Connor, hey, hey, before you do it, I need to, I need you to look at me and say, Brendan, I agree. I'm, will, I'm risking the consequences. I, I'm gonna look at some stuff first. Okay. Metal bear arm. Because like it's <laughs> if I lose it on this point, Connor, it's over. it went into the thing's mouth. Oh yeah, no, You'd I, have to, uh, you're gonna have to go shoulder deep. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet horse fucking. I, I, no, I you are sperminating a cow, but it's a mouth and it's full of teeth. We're already so fucked. Why does this always turn sexual? Yeah, no, do it. Barnyard animal sex. Okay, hang on. I want to look. So it's going to make an attack if I roll less than 15, or is it going to just automatically do damage? It's just going to automatically do damage. Okay. You're putting your arm in its mouth. I still have You're damage. doing 90% of the work it's of a bus. It's just got totally. people's shoulder deep, deep in a horse. That's like a goat going up to a wolf okay. and putting its neck in the wolf's yeah. Like, the wolf just has to meh. And then yeah, but if there was a, a hoof-compatible sword in the wolf's really mouth... Good. The book's pretty good. Buddy. You lost both of them? I need... No, no, I have the book. I'll use the book. I yeah. need your decision. I don't have second wind. I don't have stone's endurance. I don't have my action surge. I don't have any luck. <laughs> we are dead. I have nothing. No, I can't do the damage I would take if I got bit. Connor? What? Heroes. <laughs> <laughs> Heroes die, but one glorious death. <laughs> Cowards die a thousand. I have inspiration. You do have inspiration. I have never used it once. If ever there was a fucking time, I would like to use inspiration. Okay, roll, roll. See what you get. Okay. A five. Okay. Ooh. Is it? Wait, what's the modifier? Dex. Yeah. So I think it's zero for you. Uh, is it a saving throw or it's is it a saving throw? Saving throw dex zero. Okay, Re use your inspiration, roll again. Oh, daddy. Two. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> oh no. Change your dice. You reach in and suddenly the mouth clamps down on your arm, dealing 18 damage. Okay, that's survivable. That's survivable. Does he still have Change an arm? arm? Nope. Wait, I don't have an arm. Oh, no, no. Uh, oh, I don't have an arm. 
I heard that is, did he still grab the sword? The answer is no. It's still in the mouth. Yeah, 18 damage is enough Project to take goes the ridiculous. Can you, you start rooting around? Scar from dying. Okay. Can uh, you start rooting around in him and yanking on organs? Uh, it's the Grell's turn, and it's going to go after the easiest prey it can find. Prick. Let me just double. I, I just want to the majority something. of its damage. I mean, if he does damage to me, I'm dead, right? I don't even get to do, like, a what dreams may come conversation with my dead father this time. I'm just out. Well, I mean, again, <laughs> we'll, we'll see what happens, depending on how your saving throws go. The Grail attacks you and miss, you might be fine. But if it hits me, that... If it hits you, it counts as a critical hit. It's as it's, it's though I had rolled two dice. It, it, okay. it's, if the creature hits you, it's the same thing as if you had rolled a, a natural one on your saving throws, which would be two failures. Gotcha. Okay, here Not we go. Amazing. Um... 15? Nope. That's a miss? That's a miss. Oh, thank God. Okay. My AC is 16. Woo! What do I roll for these, by the way? Um, well, hold on. We'll get to that. Uh, he's dead. Steven, your turn. So, after I run back to that spot that I'm at now and I turn around, I let, go to yell back to Lou for some healing and I see that he's down. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna sprint back at the chippering mouth there. Uh, do you want to try to stabilize Lou? That'd be neat. Because if you want any healing, my medicine oh, wait. is I'm just now. Here's the thing: if you stabilize, you, you will still be unconscious, but you won't have to make death saving throws anymore. But can I make them to try and succeed? I mean, yeah, but again, if you don't, so here's the thing, right? With death saves, if you get a natural twenty, you're, you're back. back up with one HP. Mm. But if you if you just get three successes without a nat twenty, you're just you're you're stable, but you're still unconscious. Oh. You will be unconscious until you receive healing or you guys rest. He has to keep making them until he makes three successes or three failures. You, want that? you know what? I do have inspiration. You know what? I'm, I'm going to try and do medicine like on him and I'll use my inspiration. No, 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 no. Because okay. if you stabilize him, then he definitely won't become conscious. And if he gets conscious with one HP. Do you want to risk that? I'll risk the one. Yeah. You want to risk one turn of being unconscious? So, yeah. Okay. Okay. So... I'm still going to run in. Okay. Can you but I'm going to pull out double daggers and try and right. stab them into the Still need powders. that saving throw, though. Wisdom, right? Yes. And strength. Well, technically, he's not within 10 feet of the creature yet. Yeah, you so. should throw them daggers. He's down. within 20 feet, which means he has to do the wisdom. But when he gets within 10... You should just throw that daggers, man. I would throw the dagger, buddy. Yeah, I'm going to throw the daggers. Okay, mm-hmm. but I still need that wisdom saving throw. Even if I don't move? Yes. You're within 20 feet of it. No, right? yeah, if I don't move, move originally, if I just throw the daggers oh, from where I'm at. Well, uh, let's see here. 5, 10, 15, 20. What's the range on your dagger if you throw it? How, well, it's cold that? out, so. If it's yeah. less than 20, you're fine. Where would I find that? Okay, so if you go to your oh, item. There it is. 60 yeah. feet. 20, 20 foot, 60 foot. So okay, it's shit. so, okay, so it's, it's just close enough that you won't suffer disadvantage. Gotcha. Go ahead. Two weapon fighting, can I throw both of them or just one? You can, but the second one, you don't get to add any modifiers to it. It's just a straight d20 roll. Okay, so my first roll is, so 15 plus two, so 17. Okay, 17 hits, roll your damage. Five damage. Okay, all right, it's looking, it's not looking super healthy, Steven. And then the second dagger. Straight d20, just roll a d20, no modifiers. Oh, if you get a natural, man. 11. Okay. Well, you still hit. Okay, cool. But if you had gotten a natural man, I would have, I would have blown you right here. <laughs> Everyone leave for twelve minutes. Uh, six damage on the second dagger. All right, dogs oh, are afraid of. Okay, Steven, this gibber thing is it. it's so fucking weak, man. Ah. It's so fucking weak. Ah. Not as weak as me. All right, we got a fire. Roll a d twenty. Make a saving throw here. You want it? You want a twenty? So Other than that, it's kind of fun. Yeah, that's a ten. Okay, that's a success. That's a success. It's not a 20, but it's a success. But it's not a nine. It's not a, it's true. Okay. I mean, it, it is actually exactly the same effect oh, as a nine. Oh no, it's gonna bite you because you're the closest. God, what have I done? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm out then, huh? Or no, I'm gonna take two crits. Thank you guys. It bites itself. So Acceptable. Yeah. So um, it's it's like oozing up. It's like, and then all of a sudden, um, from a, from the previous acid arrow, a loose chunk of the ceiling breaks off and clunks right on top ah, of it. Nice. It takes. Um, I'm gonna be charity. Not to mention my D4. Yeah. Oh. Also, it takes two D4. God is on my. Oh! 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 Okay. Okay. Holy Tyler. Fuck Tyler. My dick. Tyler. Oh my God. You gotta get more than three. 
die! Yes! Yeah, oh, so all of a sudden, shit. you just, like, all of a sudden, it, it starts to bubble a little bit, oh and then it gets God. more, and it's... Holy I've been fuck popping my shots cock. I've been popping shots at that bitch for so god. Woo! Dude, Dude the now there's one! There's <laughs> no way you would have survived. No, it would have fucking shit. killed me. Welcome! Okay, one of them's dead. Uh, and I'm inside the guys, other. Guys, I think you might be invincible. <laughs> the Grell's still alive. I told you, I rolled a nat 20 um, for luck when I was born. All right, so so Vecin, it's Vecin's turn. He has to make the wisdom saving throw, not the strength one, because he's too far away for that. Yes, okay. So he's 5'10". He's dragging you into this room. He puts you inside there, and he's going to guard the door just so the thing doesn't try to get you. Can he crossbow somebody too? Um, unfortunately, no. That was, that his, was an action. His was action dragging. was to move Kellen. Don't worry, I'll have somebody else to drag her in a second when I'm unconscious. Okay. <laughs> cool. Uh, Protect, you're up. It's just the, the floating brain now? Or no? We no, no, no. We killed that one guy. of the gibbery mounds is dead, but there's still one gibbery mound and one grab. Oh, right. Fireball, because Very I don't want to waste any spell slots. Fireball or fire? I'm sorry, firebolt. Okay. I don't, don't want to waste any spell slots. Because I don't want to waste any spell slots. The grell uh, might be the wise move here. Yeah, grell, grell's pretty fucked up. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, does a 12 hit? Yes. Then, I, then yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh, no. For the grell or for the mouth? Whatever the one it hits for. That's I need to know which one you're aiming at. That was the not mouth. The mouth. The mouth. That would hit the mouth. Yes. All right, and uh, roll your damage. Rolling damage. Uh, eleven. Okay, that's not bad. It's not it's good. good. I'm inside it. No, I mean, dude, like you're. No, I think you should be able to grab a uvula and like yank. Listen, you're doing what you, church bell. You're right. doing what a wizard needs to do, and that is to hang back Just and pepper kill it with bug bites. Pepper him, yeah. Yeah. All right. Is there anything that you want to do with your turn? Uh, besides saying na 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 boo boo, stack your head. Perhaps you'd nope. like to stabilize Kellen. Can I? Yes. You can make a medicine check, and if you get a ten or better. Oh, anyone can do that, right? Yeah, I will do it now. No, okay. okay. Let's see. Oh, Five. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, you're you're um, you're not quite you're it's not it's quite close enough. On your next turn, you can go. I roll the ten perfectly. Oh, Sorry, man. It's you, fine. You can't make it. Move. It's cool. We want him to get back up with one HP so we can be a pig, anyways. Okay. That'd be so good because I would uh, be alive then. I love to pig out. I love being alive. Why do you keep dying? My favorite pastime. Because I, the same way I play video games, I run at the enemy and then I'm like, oh, it can hit me too. <laughs> Didn't realize that. Please, you're up. I'm gonna hit him with a book. First, wisdom saving throw. Fucking damn it. You know what? Talk to fucking HP Lovecraft, but you can't. He's in hell, okay? Where he belongs. 14? Yes. He doesn't okay. know he's in hell, though. He just thinks he's in another country. Okay. <laughs> and then? Food here is uh, terrible. I'm not moving. I'm just hitting him. If you're not moving, then then that's fine. Okay. Sweet. Okay, guys. Yank out guts. Hit him with a book. Uh, a 12 plus 8, 20 unnaturally. That's a hit. So, <laughs> 1d8 plus 6, and that's a 3 plus 6, so that's 9 damage. Oh, yeah. 9 damage. And okay. now I'm going to hit him again. Okay, do it. You guys are getting there. So, 10 plus 8, 18. Okay. Nah, so, another d8 plus 6. So, another 3 plus 6, so another 9. 9, okay. So 18 damage. Good All system. right, now, you know what? Any damage is good damage. Uh, no, I okay. have the grapple. All right. <laughs> it's the grapple. Don't, don't, don't. You cannot grapple. <coughs> I'm thinking. It's I'm a not living gra- fucking puddle. Man. I'm not. I'm not grappling. I'm Listen, the only thing you can do is bonus action or move. If you move, you have to make the strength saving throw. I uh, don't. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. All right. Enter. So the grapple is going to try and get uh, Kellen, but but. So he's got to go through Vecna. He he's got to get past Vecna. Vecna has his crossbow uh, fucking uh, ready. Man. That's good. Uh, let's see, Vecan. Okay, here we go. Let's see. I'm fucking stressed. <laughs> <laughs> then I'm doing my job. You're yeah, stressed. Oh, I'm yeah, unconscious. That's a hit. Fuck it. So he goes, um, go to hell. <laughs> Yay! He crumples to the floor. Fuck let's go. Thing. Now with my hand inside of the mouther. Guys! <laughs> Can we refocus? <laughs> Do you guys know the Australian puppet comedian Randy Feltface? Yeah. Yeah. Did you see the thing when he was talking about how he got into comedy because of his uncle? And he lost all feeling in his left hand because of a previous accident? So he was on one of those crotch rocket mini bikes, and he grabbed the tailpipe, which was burning hot, but he didn't realize that because he has no feeling in his fucking hand, right? 
his it was so hot his hand got fused to the tailpipe. Good. So Randy, who had a driver's permit, is driving his wasted dad and uncle to the Australian hospital. The man walks in holding the bike, goes up to the receptionist and goes, I've had a bit of mischief. <laughs> <laughs> that is what I meant. Please elbow deep in, a, in an eldritch abomination goes, Fellas, I've had a bit of mischief. <laughs> I assume I'm not actually elbow deep in it anymore. No, you're not. Yeah. You're not. <laughs> but you were like, owie. <laughs> the idea of it becoming a My solid around him. A pain Charlie, you bit me. Image. Lou, you're up. Or, uh, <laughs> Steven. I'm, no, I'm in fact down. Wow. <laughs> Suddenly, Racist. Steven's offended by God. White. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and kind of all the same guy. I'm going to try and do a medicine check on Lou. No! <laughs> See if he just gets back up on his own with one age. Oh, yeah, just so or he could oh, get a yeah. one and fucking die. No, yeah. if I get a one, I, then it's two. But if you, get, if you get a one, that's two failures. So, so what happens if you get a, a, a fail and then a natural one? So I'm saying, I'm saying, while I've still got three, let me try and keep rolling. And then once I get to two, then I don't roll again and I... Steven, and then what if I, what if I fuck up? Look at me. I, <laughs> look at me. Be a good friend. Fucking stabilize him. I want to get up! <laughs> I'll get you up. You got your thing with the mine, okay? It's never, you're never gonna do anything that cool. With but my I hands not still. But so I don't know how the worked exactly. Uh, what was so my, you can re-roll. I'm gonna do that. Okay. <laughs> what was my thing in the mine again? You, you like, you, you. you got back up and you oh, had that right. heartfelt conversation with your dad. That was the mine, I forgot. Yes, yeah. I do remember Yeah, that. you pinned your whole Ten? life up. fucking Jaw. On a single you, dice. Yeah, just scummed it out. Lou, nice. you no longer need to make saving throws. Okay. You're just an unconscious just bitch. Really not super useful. So that was my action. Correct? I mean, you're not dead. Take the W. Was okay. that an action or a bonus? With action? my hand. I that mean, was an action. Just for comedic okay. effect, I'm going to say my hand yeah, still no, in it, but it's not actually in it anymore. Just like, I think I got this. <laughs> So, Gibbering Mouther gets to go. It's gonna try and bite, please. And now we'll I'd be fucking stunned if it didn't try. Oh, kind of one note there, Gibbering Mouther. I mean, dude, it's in it's it's in the name. <laughs> I'm just telling you, Gibbering Mouther, pretty much. It's gonna gibber and it's, it's gonna bite you. It's pretty much what it says on the tin. Eagle, uh, brother, and mouth. 18. Nope. All right. Is going to try and blind you. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. That's okay. Get some new material, Mouther. Uh, 17. 17 with you're, house modifiers. You're yeah. fine. No blind. Woo! No blind for you. Thank you, Dice Jesus. That's the day, race. Oh, skip, 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 here's skip, it. So Vecken yeah. yeah. is going to scooch into the corner where he's going to get a clear shot at the Mouther. Throw some shit, dude. Uh, and he's just outside the radius, so he does not need to wisdom saving throw. I get it, I get it. But I get up again. Uh, Ain't ever going to keep me down. I'm currently down. Oh, shit. That's a... So he, he like, shoots it, but it's just, like... It no gets damage. like sucked in, no damage. Protect, you're up. Uh, Do the thing. Oh, uh, stable on? Okay. Uh, I mean, just, no, any, any answers? Of, any uh, answers? Of do right. anything. Now, here's the thing. Please is in your path. So I can't firebolt? You, you gotta get around, please. Uh, I get around, please. Okay. Gotta firebolt! Be able to hit him. Go for it. 19. Oh, yeah, that's a hit. Roll your damage. Nine. All right. Nice. I thought it was more than that. Okay. Fate had other plans. <laughs> dead, 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 dead. Dead. Currently dead. a monstrosity. Dead, dead, <laughs> dead, dead. <laughs> Are you listing my list of X's? <laughs> hey, oh, high fives, nobody. Please, Please suddenly feels very tired. <laughs> <laughs> um, so first off, wisdom saving throw. Yep. And I have- And this. strength if you want to move so your friends I'm can- I'm not gonna. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I thought maybe you'd be a not selfish asshole and you'd want your friends to be able to take a No, because you I, met Connor. I mean, he just took nine damage. I mean, I, he's almost done for. Yeah, fair enough. I have nothing. I have no luck points. I have no inspiration. I have no nothing. Just, just luck of the luck of the draw, baby. Eighteen. That's a hit. Okay, roll your damage. No, 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 no. That's my wisdom save. Oh, okay, yes. Uh, <laughs> still good. Now roll the hit. And I'm not gonna move, so no strength. So now I'm rolling the hit. Okay. Nat twenty. <gasps> Woo! Oh, no. So, so real quick, real quick. Uh, what, what is the damage for your book? A D eight plus six. So that's eight, 14. nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Roll. Okay. Another six. Twenty six. Twenty damage. What does this look like? Oh, damn. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a little scene here, real quick. Presmer, are you in there? <laughs> I hate you! 
hooked on phonics! <laughs> <laughs> and then I drop the book down the fucking center of him. And like, I assume do the samurai. <laughs> you, you do. It stands there fine for a couple of seconds and then just... <laughs> um, Splooge. One of the mouths by your foot. It's like, fuck you, please. You always be a monster. Uh, I step yeah. on it. <laughs> and I say, with the power of friendship. <laughs> We've already and worked through I, this. And I go like this and expect Lou to throw me his flask because I need a drink after the last atrocity I've just committed and uh, realize he's unconscious. <laughs> okay. So oh, Lou, you, uh, you guys fucking did it! Uh, Woo! Yes! Uh, we are the only true gods. We were so close to not uh, doing it. Do, do, uh, I was fine. sit down where I am and take a rest. We're taking a short rest. <laughs> can I, yeah, can the short rest give me an HP? It will, it will. Go ahead, man. Okay. Uh, Mark oh, a short rest on your own. Oh. Oh, oh, I'm taking every fucking now, point. I assume I get my sword back from the... Oh, yeah, it's okay. it's like drained. Gross. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna grab my daggers, too. <laughs> you, uh, you're like, does anyone have a moist towelette? <laughs> Two, seven health All right, for so me. you give yourself, you have seven health total. So, uh, do you guys want to look around the room at all? Yeah. So, but by the way, there's all of the things that were dead bodies are now bits of this thing, right? Um, yeah, but you know what? You, uh, Steven and Lou, now that the, the fighting is over, you realize that you are in a, a study. Um... There's a glowing crystal sphere illuminating the chamber, and there is a uh, wooden floor, okay. and it has a couch and a tall bookcase. Can I try and do an investigation check on the floors, see if there's any, like, weird, like, bits sure. of flooring or anything? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, um, investigation? Yeah. yeah, investigation. This whole time, please. Fifteen? Laying Fifteen? Oh, uh, yeah, you don't, you don't find any, uh, like, secret compartments or anything. Okay, uh, I'll just but check you know what? Some of these books on this bookshelf look pretty good. That's what I was about to say. I'm gonna check out the bookshelf. Yeah, if there's a uh, dark mythology, studies of aberrant magic, mad treatises on elder gods. Like these are very forbidden, but and dangerous, but not unvaluable books. I'm we could sell them. Gonna grab everything. I mean, candle I can keeps going. Candle keep would keep. probably give you yeah. guys a fair price. For yeah, yeah, yeah. that's okay. what I'm, I'm thinking. Um, but the rest of you. Um, I am gonna walk out and uh, slug off my flask and then drop it on Pleasure's chest. Okay, you pour it into his mouth. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm Before we go anywhere, I, I am star. Picture. No, let my character fall over. I'm starfished on the floor, fucking exhausted. Okay, um, Protech and Lou and Please, do you guys want to search this room at all? I do. Okay. Yeah, I kind of like slowly sit up, take a gigantic <laughs> swig of that. All right. And then, I want to look uh, through this. Tyler, look at the statue. What general area would you like to investigate? Towards the circle that's like right closest here? to you. Yeah, that corner. Okay. Uh, go ahead and make me an investigation check, please. Oh, yeah, baby. It's like my best step, boy. 16. Ooh, baby. Okay. Uh, so you find a secret door. Oh, secret door, secret door, secret door. Uh, Tyler, as you enter the said secret Team door. Team secret door. Um, Team secret door. This, this small dark chamber holds a golden urn resting atop a small table and a bookcase stuffed with books and scrolls, many of them old and worn. Do I investigate them and try to see if I can get anything, I can read anything on them? Sure. I see Dumb. this, um, I, I see that it looks well, sketchy you're, you're, in there. You're doing your own thing. You're starfish. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> uh, so Tyler, you see um, <laughs> arcane formulas, alchemical recipes, ritual instructions, lore about the outer planes. Um, do you speak deep speech at all? Deep speech, that's, that's, <laughs> It's when you talk about NFTs, right? Um, no, I don't. I'm sad, but yeah, so unfortunately, it's all Greek to you. You see, uh, there are some older books and uh, some journals written by Lord Vialis. Mm. Uh, oh, they're all in languages I don't know, though? Yes. Uh, however, you read uh, in one of uh, his later journal entries, a ritual says that he placed the cremated remains of his wife and children in a golden urn that he uses as a focus for dark rituals. Wow, maybe that's why he died. He's like, honey, I need something to amplify my powers. Well, but there's also a golden urn in this room. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. yeah. Good. We point. know what's that in that from now. Lord Vi uh, Viagra, whatever. Viagra yellow card, yes. Yeah. Uh, now, so while you're doing that, please and uh, Lou, what do you Why guys? wouldn't you say Cialis? I want to look behind the monster <laughs> statue. Okay. Uh, go ahead and roll me an investigation check. 
Sir Blue Chew? No, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> you said there were creepy tunnels? Yellow Chew? Like uh, so these, these are pits that seem to lead pills. to a lower level. Wait, do that. I would like to do my investigation in that direction. Okay. Um, you kind of hold a torch over the hole, and you see a lot of ashes and bones down there. As far as you can figure, the cult, after they murdered people, they would just dump their remains down these holes. Hashtag mass grave. There's, there's a lot down there, man. Should I cast speak with dead with the mass grave, guys? Ah, oh, no, oh, I feel like I'd get so a bad. really bad headache. Sounds like a DMV. Yeah, that sounds bad. <laughs> anyway, I got a 19. Oh, 20, because okay. I have plus one. Uh, so yeah, the, the statue, um, there doesn't seem to be anything about it specifically, but you do find a secret door uh, to the right. Secret I'll tunnel. go through it. Are there any uh, more terrifying masses of flesh in it? Two wooden chests are the only objects to be seen in this dark room. One of those a is a staircase leading down. One of those is a fucking mimic. Is there a rock on the ground? Uh, sure. I be able to pick up? Yeah. I wing it at one of the chests. It bounces off the chest harmlessly. All right, I open the chest. Um, in the first chest, you find a long sword, two daggers, a pair of jewel earrings worth 150 gold pieces. Wow. Excuse me. And Delicious. 115 gold pieces. I am going to buy a diamond with those for healing spells. You should. That was uh, both chests? That was both chests. both chests. Okay. So, yeah. So, uh, can I just give myself the money for those diamond rings or the diamond earrings? No. Let me... Pre- uh, let when, me you uh, get, when you get back to Campbell Keep, you can. Okay. Well, it was 150, oh, 115 gold on its own? Yeah. Well, no. I'll give the daggers to Steven. Yeah. Okay. Does anybody want a longsword? I can't. Just, what are got, the stats of a longsword? I, got, this isn't a I pretty much sword. do magic you're, attacks. You're better off with you find? Daggers? D- two daggers and a longsword. Okay. You can have the daggers. This is probably where they take the valuables of the people they kill. Oh, this feels gross, but I'm going to keep them anyway and go downstairs. Okay. Um, I follow him when I see he's going downstairs. All right. Uh, while you guys are going downstairs, Vekin, uh, Vekin kind of limps over to you two and he goes, uh, Hey, guys, there's still a lot of people captured downstairs in the dungeon. All right. Um, I guess we'll go there. I mean, <laughs> you do, do you have the urn? Uh, I, I do grab it after I read about that those practices, yeah. Okay. Um, so as you guys are walking, you catch up to Lou and uh, please pretty quick. Hey guys, I found the Zern. Oh, I just drop it. Yeah. <laughs> no, you don't. Yeah, yeah, roll dexterity. No. Um, You're not allowed yeah, to so, drop it. so Vekin looks at you, Tyler, and he goes, uh, Classic sitcom. Well, well I'll, I'll get it, I'll get it. <laughs> I, uh, I, I think we should give them a proper burial. You think you really? You don't think the golden urn that was used for Eldridge purposes isn't that his? Uh, his girlfriend's in there. Yeah, and kid. Um, yeah. So as you guys go down, um, you see a you see a young man hiding in one of the rooms. He bears more than a passing resemblance to Old Fargo at the end. Oh shit! Oh, cool. Uh, guys, please, I, I don't want to hurt anybody. Nope, we're here to rescue you, buddy. You're, you're new Fargo, right? Thank you. Yeah, I'm young Fargo. Oh, right. These yeah, you're the series. Fargo 2.0, man. nice to meet you. These people are fucking crazy. Yeah, yeah know, we know. Right? They're also all dead. We so. were that I, noise earlier. I wanted to learn magic, but this this isn't worth it. You oh, know what? Good. The true magic is thinking for yourself. Oh. <laughs> I hope wow. I say, don't be evil and blind. I, do, I, I stroke <laughs> his hair. <laughs> we, you're going to pass a lot of corpses on your way out. Just don't look at him. Right. No, he's not, because they all oh. turned into whatever the fuck we fought. You're going to pass two really fucked up corpses on your way out. Uh, don't look at him. Vekin kind of reaches into his pockets, please, and he goes, uh, are you a wizard? You know it. He, uh, he pulls out a spell scroll of counterspell. He goes, <gasps> wow, if only I had this. <laughs> 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 You're gonna need this next time. Yeah, I definitely sure don't have cool. that. And I'm still gonna yeah, fucking. If you had it, you would have used it, right? Uh, I look at the uh, gash in my side. Yeah. <laughs> can Can Stephen or I use that? Uh, I mean, if you, if you have, <laughs> said numb nuts over here. You already have, have counter spell. <laughs> if you have the ability to use magic, you can use a spell scroll. Okay. Does it add to your spells or does it replace a spell? No. Yeah, so Just like his ring of chump. It, it's, like, it's like a free use of a spell. Once you okay. use it, the spell the It's a one-time use. Oh, gotcha. should we, do we use a spell slot when we use it? No. Nice. You, you read the scroll and the scroll evaporates and then the spell happens. Ah, uh-huh. okay, cool. Yeah. Gotcha. Think, think, uh, think um, Skyrim. Yeah, the same way it goes there. Okay. Nice. Um, But yeah, it looks like you guys have, have pretty much um, got everything you need. Concluded. We got Door number back to town. We got everything from that one room before we went in to fight everybody, right? At our last yes. session? 
There was some some scroll with a bunch of spells on it. Or yeah, whatever. there was a spell book. You did take that. Okay, cool. Was there anything else that I'm forgetting about from that room? I want my. I don't think Just so. a spell book. I mean, there, oh, there was the the the. the Summoning so oh, the, or you the, could talk to Gerdu if you wanted to. Ooh, I kind of want to. Oh, yeah, we go back. And talk we gotta to go back. Yeah. We all go stay in the circle. Uh, no, uh, it's only built for one. Can we all like Can photo we... booths? <laughs> 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 I'm gonna you know what, Tyler? Tyler, roll an Arcana check for me. Ooh, fuck ten. Um, okay. It was so close to an at twenty. You yes. might know how to make it fit more people, but it could also explode. Fifty-fifty. Guys, how much damage does the explosion do? Who's to say? Enough. <laughs> at least, know, at like... least eight d six. Okay, well you for it. Well, you, <laughs> while you do it, I'll wait outside, and if you all die, I'll just oh, okay. put in corpse. Have you, you say eight d six or eight d six? Jesus. Yeah. Oh wait, so that's going to be more than your max HP. So, well, let's just do one person at a time. Yeah, I got nineteen temporary HP right now. All right. I don't think he's going to talk to everybody. <laughs> Fine. Probably, probably not. I've got kind of go Who? Okay, so guys, I, I, who wants to do this? I, I, I want to go. I was the last oh, one. But I feel like I should talk to Presmer. Because I bet I can talk you to Presmer. Talk to Presmer. I bet I can. It's just. No, I've it's already a, been in the It's circle. a direct line to just the, guy. the guy. The, yeah, yeah, well, the elder I, one. Yeah, the red one. Okay. So. I, well, I, you I, already I, got to talk to him. I was in a hole. I should talk no, to him. I need to finish. Storytelling. Okay. So I step back into the circle and. Feel my myself fade away yeah, into a different. Yeah. Once again, you're standing before a massive creature. It's got like a black cloak. You can make out like these these fly like eyes, long clawed arms, and, and tentacles for legs. And he goes, uh, Stephen, you and your friends have proven yourselves to be exceptional annoying. I think we did what exactly what we promised. I stopped you. You have stopped nothing. Your kind issues your existence in years and decades, but we will return. We shall remain even your civilization is induced thus. All you are is eternally damned to hell. You will stay exactly where you are if there's anything me and my friends can do to stop you. Yeah, yeah. You will die and we did. And when you do, others will rise. My children will bring me about this exchange. Is over. You find yourself back in the room. Oof. <laughs> How was he? Was he little, chill? Uh, a little grumpy, if I have to say so. But I think I got <laughs> the point across. Oh, neighbor. Yeah, we share a very... Protex, like, what's his race? <laughs> <laughs> um, well, so... Um, so Irish. you guys... Um, <laughs> to Kennedy. Oh, to Tarrant. Yeah, you guys want to rest at the end? Well, I want, I want to, to rest at the end and sell things and have adoring uh, fans. Okay, yeah. Someone and buys your earrings for you. I'm, I'm holding young Fargo as I walk up. Oh, the one thing I forgot to ask you about the grill. Was there anything like worth taking like poison or anything from them? Anything like salvage uh, from honestly, them? Honestly, actually, There's a coin you know in here. what, Steven? Do me a favor and roll a survival check. Panito. Okay, so you kind of take your dagger and you, you kind of carve into the grill and you find this kind of, this this sack, and you it's determine that balls. this must be where it contains its venom. Nice. You you manage to carefully extract the sack. So I'm gonna say, if you want to, you can coat a weapon of your choosing with uh, paralyzing poison. Fuck yeah. Nice. Extract your boy, the crystal sack. sword. <laughs> Just stack the sword. <laughs> well, I was gonna say, it would be better for one of your daggers. Yeah, 100%. Because you, you can throw it So you could out. be useful. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'm, um, uh, definitely yeah, so so you guys are you guys are are, are having a few drinks. Uh, yes. Vecan has paid for all of your beers, uh, and he yeah. uh, he kind of goes, uh, "Hey, would you guys? I hate to ask you this, but could you help me do one more thing?" Anything for you, buddy? What do you need? We did we we so we rescued before we get to this last thing. Uh, <laughs> we rescued Young Fargo, which was a side mission. Did we get the, it's the mayor's mayor. Yes, you guys managed to get all. They were. Very malnourished, but they're okay. Everybody's I don't gone. want any vampire situations going on here. No, no, no. They were just very beaten and starved. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. Ah, just ah, beaten and starved. Right, that's fine. Um, so, yeah. So, Vecan goes, um, if you guys would accompany back, me back to Waterdeep, I'd really like to give Lady Yellowcrest and the little ones a proper burial. Agreed. It's what they deserve. Then I carry him out of there. Love Please is already sh- oh, Where oh, we Well, hold on, you guys. You guys got to spend the night. It's, oh, it's you know, and uh, and um, you know, Vecan, he goes like, if you guys ever need me, 
I'll come. Do you have like a That's trumpet we can blow? <laughs> well, <laughs> you can you can send me a message to my to my home in Waterdeep. That's the one. That's the one. <laughs> it's a Waterdeep hey, uh, Avenue. Hey, please. Yeah. I I heard that stuff that your friend said about you, and he didn't know what he was saying. Yeah. Was, Listen, I, for what it's worth, even if you did some stuff you're not proud of during the war, he war did. Crimes, he did. You. A lot of you helped someone. A lot of you helped a girl achieve rest, and you helped a woman and her children, even after everyone else had already given up on them. The only thing I hope for is before I die, I can make up for the things I've already done. I think you're on a good start. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we will. Next adventure. <laughs> on It's Just, just Chris! Chris. It's not uh, Damn, it was such a good time! <laughs> um, so, you guys, uh, go ahead and mark yourselves down for a long rest. Yay, hey, all my health. Dungeon Daddy. My blood is back in me now. My blood, it found its way home! <laughs> and then also, it's the um, end of Milo and Otis. Also, give yourselves back half of your expended hit dice. Oh, uh, shit, half? I only used one, so thanks. I thought a long rest was a complete reset. Nope. Okay. Every long rest, you get half your spent dice back. I spent so many fucking dice. Whoa, we got a lot done. Oh, we, 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 we have done much. And there's still more to come. Uh, so you guys, uh, you guys get back to Waterdeep. You go to the City of the Dead. It's, it's like this massive like park, but also graveyard. Mm-hmm. Dope. Uh, <laughs> Damn, that is some epic shit. I like it. so funny. It's kind of like a kid's birthday party, but a mausoleum. Vecan manages to find a a priest of Kelimbor to do a a funeral. Uh, After the priest (laughs) kind of scatters the ashes in the grave, he, you know, he, he prays that they will find uh, embrace with the I want to play a little music in the background. Uh, And as you do that, suddenly... The specter of a young woman appears. To everybody oh my god, a ghost. Guys. Oh, okay, fuck. Three children appear with her. She kind of leans down and hugs them all. Oh. And she looks at each of you with a, a look of great appreciation. And then suddenly, Sarah's ghost <coughs> comes into view. She walks up to you, Protect, <gasps> and she does that thing where she like, touches your head and she touches her forehead to your forehead. <laughs> um, she walks up to Vecan, who is just weeping at this point and uh he just he he's struggling for words and all he can say is he just looks at her and he says i love you and i miss you and uh they, I love it. yeah thank you they, love it. they embrace um sarah kind of floats over to lady yellowcrest and the children they all hold hands and then they're just gone and out from the grave four moths just kind of take off. Uh, the one moth kind of flutters onto your finger, Protec, and it kind of just flaps its wings, and then it just goes off into the moonlight. Yeah. A single oh, tear it's... rolls down Steven's eye. <laughs> single Steve oil Steve drip. Just... You guys did a good thing. Yeah. Why are there always dead people at the end of our adventures? You guys ever think about that? Yeah. I try not to. How's your eye, bud? Uh, further scarred. Which one? <laughs> Look at my arm. <laughs> <laughs> at least you have it still. I definitely, you shouldn't have I definitely think that I should get negative two charisma because my face looks fucked right now. <laughs> so you guys, uh, you make your way back to Candlekeep. You wake up in the morning, you all go down for breakfast, and you notice that the whole place is a buzz. There's kind of like decorations put up all over the place. Um, you notice there's a lot of comfortable beanbags set out for people to sit on. Uh, and you see Bookworm, and he looks absolutely distraught. He's like looking through stuff, and he's, he's freaking out, and he's muttering to himself. What do you do? What do you do? Huh? Oh, uh, hi, hi, please. <laughs> I open my tummy and show him all like the really cool books that we found. Uh, y- yeah, that's wonderful. Just uh, put them over there somewhere. You, I, are you stressed to like normal style, or is something else? You, you always something love books. Something seems What's wrong, wrong Mr. Well, Lem. I started an initiative called the Scholars of Tomorrow. Okay. Essentially, we let some of the local children come in. We show them around the library, we read them some books, and they're all great. Well, the thing is, little one was supposed to read Larry the Lonely Ogre. Mm -hmm. (gasps) But that's such a good story. He's very sick. Oh, no, shit. Yeah, no, he's, uh, I don't know, we think he caught the flu or something. And then all of a sudden, you see. (laughs) 
<laughs> so you see, you see your friend Fembris, and he comes in with a shovel, and it's got brown stuff on it. He goes, nobody go into the garden until I say it's okay. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, he must not be feeling good. We should check in on him. It's coming out of both <laughs> ends. <laughs> Jesus. It's called a spiral. <laughs> My boy's a pinwheel. <laughs> uh, so you go, wait, Stephen, you, you're a performer. Maybe you could, maybe you could put on a little show for the kids for me. It would really help. Maybe you, you could clean up the shit. Oh god. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Um, that, that, I, I think we could arrange something. Um, when are you expecting them? Um, what time is it now? Uh, thirty minutes. Uh, oh. Yeah, I should I should be able to whip something up. Uh, just give me a little time. Great. Um, we, we do have a couple of kids' books on the shelf over there. Feel free to take anyone you think you can work with. Oh, I, I, I've got a wonderful story. Don't don't even worry about it. Oh, really? Yeah. What, what story would that be? Uh, I was uh, actually I was going to tell them about uh, when you had us go over and help the uh, village of frog people, and and uh, we saved the village and you know stopped stopped all the the. It's Nazis. Oh, and they ate babies, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nah. He, he kind of goes like, I just want to make sure I understand because I feel clarity is very important here. You yep. wish to tell small children about the baby-eating half-snake, half-men who I read, I would love to emphasize, ate babies. Yeah, we call them Nazis. Aha. Uh -huh. Could we do something a little less traumatizing, maybe? We're doing we're this one. I guess so, look through the guys, guys, I have the perfect story. So we were running into this thing that's an amalgamation of monsters. I'm going to stop you right there. Um, I guess I'll look I at the books. Read. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's many wonderful ones over there. All right. I flipped through. Any, any titles sticking um, out of me? So you, you look through. Um, there doesn't appear to be any like. I mean, you know, there's a couple of, you know, classics, but there's one. It has an absolutely beautiful cover that jumps out at you. Oh, I don't think I've seen this one before. Like uh, I would like to show you a picture. Please. So you nice. see, this thing has a beautiful leather purple Ooh. cover. It's got one of those little uh, snappy doodles on the sides. Wow. And on the cover is a golden embossed unicorn. Nice. And the book is titled Lore of LaRue. I kind of run my hand over the embossed uh, unicorn. Uh, this it's, looks great. Yeah, very, very old, but lovingly crafted. Yeah, uh, I, I think I found the book for us, Bookworm. Oh, Lord of LaRue, a classic. Can I go to pop it open? Sure, why don't you all go to your quarters, read up, and um, any, way, you know, any props or anything you need, come find me and we'll get you set up. Perfect. I think I would move to go check on the little one. Um, you go into Little One's room and it's kind of like Elf where he's yeah. three sizes too big for this bed <laughs> and he's like... An ice pack on the forehead. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> jeez. Can I get you anything, buddy? Ginger um, no, that's okay. Sneeze. <laughs> 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 uh, do me a favor, roll a dexterity saving throw. Oh, baby, I know that's plus This zero. kills you. Yeah, Corona. <laughs> Nine plus Monkey box. Seven? That's the new one. It's a new hot trend. Can I get a dexterity one. saving throw? Is it's plus zero, so nine. Nine. A cannonball-sized snot. <laughs> Barely misses you. Oh my god! And you feel the trail kind of oozing your cheek. down the wall, and goes. Sorry, I'm not feeling very well. Okay, well if I can uh, get you anything, let me know, buddy. Thank you. <coughs> I drive <laughs> out the door. <laughs> 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 the and door you closes the door, on its hinges. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> um, yeah. So you guys are you guys are um hang out in your quarters. Who's gonna start reading the book? Not me. No, can I? Wait, no, can I? Can you guys teach me how to read the book? <laughs> yeah, can I sit there, like, with, uh, please, right behind my back and, like, um, go over the words very slowly? Of course. Um, as Once you open it, upon. the page is blank. Huh. But suddenly, the writing begins to appear on the page. Well, this is new. Is this what every book does? Yeah, no, this is how no, no, this is different. But this is different. <laughs> the book, the page says, our story starts during the time leading up to the winter solstice on the final night of Uktar in the year 374 DR. A nearly full moon rises behind the wispy clouds as a star-speckled sky Please darkens against this point. a fading horizon. Mm -hmm. It seems silent and still here in the heart of the forest. But to anyone who knows the forest well, that silence can be misleading. Then a sentence begins to appear under that. 
When you are ready to proceed, turn the page. Steven, if you want, real quick, can you roll me a history check? What? Did you, uh, did you roll a death threat? Sure. Death saving threat? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, we skipped over the part where I take damage? Well, you were yep. dead the moment you picked the book up, but could you roll? <laughs> the book actually away. eats souls. 17. <laughs> it seems like the final night of Uktar in year 374, that happened about 338 years ago. Roughly a Tuesday. Lou, okay. do you remember? Uh, but as I am not that age, old. Suddenly, you begin to, like, the whole room begins to spin around you. Is like, this normal books? <laughs> <laughs> is this what reading <laughs> is? <laughs> <laughs> you There's every you, book, Jumanji! You, you find yourself in a brisk but not frigid forest. It's Jumanji! <laughs> and that ah. is where we're gonna leave. Yeah. This episode of It's Just Chris! Next time on It's Just Chris, Lore of the Rue, the boys are stuck into a story. They're going to meet new friends and possibly, please, we'll meet a new love interest. Her names, thank you. <laughs> Can the boys foil a plot by the evil gata of the hunt? Find out next time on It's Just Crits! Oh.